Do you have a Green Lantern list that is actually good? I can't get a good win rate on mine, but also I don't have Jon Stewart, so that sucks. Yeah, Jon Stewart is, is kind of a critical piece of that equation. Sometimes Jon provides that last little poke, the last little hit you need to knock out a leader, especially if they have some big guards. Why don't we just build a new deck here from, from scratch? But uh, chat, what are we thinking here? What, 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 what do we think would be a good match for Hal Jordan? Wonder Woman, I like that. Yeah, we have two threes, uh, one, one two charge champion, one three charge champion. Why don't we call this the ring of truth instead of the lasso of truth. Uh, Aquaman, oh, Aquaman's not a bad choice too. Poison Ivy, I mean, that would give us some clear, either one of those. I feel like this one always comes off so toxic. I don't know, it always feels sarcastic. I like Shazam. Ooh, a challenge. Ta-da. <laughs> yeah, the thumbs up feels like Miss Marvel emote and snap 100%. Hey, let's think about this. Antiope's always a good pick. Good stats and has aura. Crypto is awesome. Fitting Mentor I was definitely thinking about, especially because we can stick in the Minotaur and then maybe pump the Minotaur up with Wonder Woman. So I do kind of like that. Super Strength is always good. Do we want a Clark Kent? Maybe, if we are gonna run Fitting Mentor. Steve Trevor. Oh man, we have a lot of bronze though already. I think, I like steel personally. Hippolyta is very strong. In terms of big might recruits we have to have, we definitely need Superman. Probably Wonder Woman, right? Yeah, Steve Trevor's cracked. I agree with that. Maybe no Minotaur and no, yeah, yeah, that's a, that's a fair point. Let me think about that. Swamp Thing, I usually run at least one Swamp Thing. Hey, Zenji, welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Hope you're having a great day. Good to have you here. I do like me some truth and justice. I'm Rain Code. Hey, thanks so much for the follow. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Hey, what's up? Thanks for the welcome, no worries. Good to have you here. So Yara is good, but she got nerfed a little bit. She used to be really good with the Batman Aqua package because similar to Paco, she used to count as a gold even when she got discounted. Let's add one more, one more gold here, I think, and we'll keep moving. I think we need at least one Wonder Woman for now. Um, I always like Ambush in our decks. I think Ambush bug is quite good. Lightning bolts are never a bad idea, but with the deck we're running, we, we want a lot of lanterns. So I would say we're gonna try to start with the lanterns here. That'll pump up everybody else. Ring Choose is always good. Uh, Chastelon, I think we're missing. Here he is. Wow, we have a lot of bronze here, but maybe that's okay. I don't know, but we do have quite a lot of bronze. Kilowog, I love. Stewart is good. Maybe we stick in one Kyle. Shazam for sure. Hellblaze, I would say. Probably two. And Hal. I pro we probably need some card draw as well. I think Supersonic Sucker Punch might do the trick. But for the Lanterns, I feel like Supersonic actually might be pretty good. I mean, maybe it's better for flurry cards, but we're, we're gonna have some big recruits that we build with the lantern. So I could see Supersonic being pretty good for us. Just see if there's anybody else we should add. We don't have a High Father. Here's here's my question for chat. Between having Swamp Thing and High Father or the Wonder Woman, because Wonder Woman is gonna be quite effective with the Wonder Woman leader card. So I'm kind of leaning towards Wonder Woman. Yeah, Wonder Woman's better. I agree with that. I'm gonna keep the Swamp Thing for now. I do like having a guard. We have Steel as the other guard. Everything else is kind of up in the air. We're just gonna play it. We'll see how it does and then we'll readjust. I think that's the plan for now. We gotta send back most of this. Chastelon's good, but like, we really need to get these bronze cards. All right, we're gonna play this. If they have a Steve Trevor, that's bad, but we'll see what we can do here. They probably have a Steve Trevor. They always do. Oh, they don't. Look at that. Guys, they don't. We get Superman. Let's go. 6-6 six, six Superman with shield. Let's go. Man, I got to be careful about the chassel on here. I think we got a shot here. I really do. Holy. <laughs> yes! Exactly! Chris Farley in the building! Oh 
Oh wow, they took six damage to the face. They didn't even they didn't even think twice about it. Okay, this is where John Stewart can actually be really fun. All right, we're gonna hold the Wonder Woman for now. Harley's down to six. We got Hippolyta next turn. Yo, Clark Kent coming in so big this game. Oh my gosh. All right, so now they can take out Clark Kent, but they gotta trade both of these. That's, that's kind of a lot to trade. All right, we want to do... We're doing something a little crazy here, guys. This is a little crazy. It's a little crazy, but it, it might just be crazy enough to work. We're going to protect the 6-6 six, six here. And we're going to take out Harley. Yeah, lethal on Harley, exactly. Yeah, Zenji, spot on, spot on. That's you know what though? We can we can manage that. I think we can manage that. We can pump it up with uh, this. Oh my gosh. The things we can do right now. Wild. Okay, you know what? Yeah. Trade. May the gods grant us their favor. Let's go. Let's go. This game is almost over. <laughs> Great game, man. Yeah, we're doing it, man. We're showing what the lanterns can do. Yo, Velent! Congrats, guys. Also, let me give a little shout out here to Velent. Velent is a fantastic DC Dual Force creator. He's been on the road a lot, traveling for work. But I'm sure uh, once he gets settled, he'll be back streaming lots more. But guys, make sure to check him out. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm, I know, it's been a lot, dude. But uh, welcome, I, I, uh, the good thing is this is GG's. And there it is, folks. We did it. We did it with the lanterns. Showing what the lanterns can do there. Wondering. <laughs> I like it, I like it. Very good. We got the ring chooses. Steve Trevor, gotta send this back. All right, I can live with that. It's a pretty, a pretty decent starting hand here. We, w we are going to start here with the ring chooses and grab a Chastelon if we can. Uh, yeah, a Chastelon. Beautiful. Uh, it's a struggle this season for sure. Yeah. For sure, man. In some ways, I'm glad that the climb is harder. Um, I, just, I just wish there were ways to get around. Like, if, if you end up having a loss because of, like, an end turn bug... I wish that didn't kill your hot streak. Like, I wish there was ways of uh, kind of getting around that. Um, all right, so Marley. Got a couple big things on the board here now. Wish there wasn't any bugs. <laughs> that would fix the problem, yeah. And you know, here's the thing. Like, I'm generally, generally speaking, I'm a patient guy, you know? I, I get that, like, things happen. It's 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 a game that's still in early access. It's gonna keep coming coming along and getting better with each subsequent fix. And so I'm just you know I'm just like all right, we'll be patient, one day at a time. All right, wow. All right, that was a good play by them. Pretty good play. We did get another Chastelon. Wow. Be a 
piece of cake. Okay, here we go, guys. Here we go. Let's go for Zatanna. Because they probably got quite a lot of spells here. Uh, we are finally getting some decent draws here. Yes. We're going to do it, guys. I got, I got a good feeling this game. Oh, wow. They pulled the battery. What are they going to do here? Well, imagine if they have just silver. Well, I'm surprised they went... What? Really? I'm a little surprised that's that's where they decided to go. Can we knock out Satana here? Right now, we currently have six, eight. Oh, we can knock out Satana. Beautiful. We're, we're going to play the Crypto just to protect Chasalon. But I'm a... I don't know. I mean, they could have a... Uh, a Hellblaze or uh, something coming up. But that's a pretty decent looking board. And Zatanna getting knocked out is pretty big. Okay, we're in business. We are in business here. May the gods grant us their favor. That's okay. Let's take the damage. We'll get a little bit of that health back. And for the rest of the game, Wonder Woman can attack. So overall, that's pretty good. Yeah, see, that's I knew that was coming eventually. It was a matter of time. Ooh, Shazam. Okay. Who do they go for? They might go face, actually. No. Wow. I think we hold Lantern. There's not a ton we want to do at the moment. <laughs> Timothy Hunter. Alright, that clears that. That's fine. Seriously? Guys, I don't know if you just saw that. I don't know if you just saw that, but what just happened there was insane. May the gods grant us their favor. All right, we're going to play Lantern, even though we don't really totally maximize our hand here, but we just got to win. I, I don't want Timothy Hunter popping the shield. We'll let them try to do it with a Lightning Bolt instead. Um, but we're kind of out of cards. So the only thing that could be bad is maybe like a Polymorph or a Bigger They Are, but they wouldn't have Bigger They Are. They might have a Hellblazer. They've, they've used one Lightning Arc. Living Lightning, okay. But that's one card for them. Oh, John Stewart's actually kind of great here. Because this is GG's, guys. 
We use John to clear, and that's the game. So two in a row here with this uh, <laughs> lantern deck. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> we dro we dropped the falcon punch there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, we go second here. Good. I like Jessica. I think we send back John Stewart. We keep the Minotaur. All right. And we'll see what we get for our first lantern card here. The first turn you create a green lantern in your hand, so we get a free card. And it's Hal. Hal's pretty good. Alright, why don't we start it off here with the Minotaur. We'll see if they want to trade. This is going to be chaotic though. And they're not going to have Adrenaline just yet. Okay, I think we're willing to trade because we can just play Jessica here. And she's a 5-4 now. I don't think Harley should be able to take her out. They might have a man bat, but we'll cross that bridge as we get there. Killua got the extra damage. Wow, he's strong. Alright, we'll have to trade here. Can you check my Zod backer list? I can, but I don't have Zod. Uh, I'm actually still... I paid for the subscription, but I'm still waiting on the mini set. So I I, I haven't played with Zod yet, uh, Acer. Uh, I'm happy to take a look at the list, but um, I unfortunately I'm still waiting to play Zod. Ah, uh, man, this is tough here. Ah, uh, this kind of sucks. Alright, uh, we gotta sacrifice steel here. They're gonna just trade it with the punchline, probably. Punchline in the back is not great for us. Uh, did I check? Yeah, I did. I've been checking the packs, like, every day. Um, I emailed the support team, so I'm, I'm just waiting for a response. They, like, sent it over to a specialist or something. Okay, yikes. I mean, if I were them, I would trade, trade, and then pop off, maybe. Or trade there. Trade there. Yeah, it's all good. I mean, it just sucks because I paid for it. So I'm just like waiting to um, just get what I paid for, you know? Now here's... Okay. I think that's the right play. Still double silver. Still double silver. Oh, I hate to do it. I hate to do it, but I'm trying to keep us alive here. They're down to one card. They're going to tap into the adrenaline most likely. We got Shazam next. Oh, man, we got a lot of gold in our hand. We've got one punchline down. I don't know how, how much other lethal stuff they have. We got a seven. We got actually two seven sevens here. So two 14 14s if we want. But you know what? Let me. I'll, I'll check again. But I, I've been checking every day. With the Halloween set, it just kind of showed up one day. So hopefully it's the same thing. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Here we 
Joker's dead. Joker is dead. 9, 16, 8. Okay. I think we got to go here with it. So we get 13 plus 7 is 20. They still do have Adrenaline, but hopefully hopefully they don't have another Bazooka. As long as they don't have another Bazooka, I think we're feeling pretty good. Ah, yes, and they got the Firepower, but just at the wrong time. So that's kind of perfect. Oh no, that could be bad. Okay, luckily it's there. I think that's still ideal. But we won it, guys. We're three in a row. We're on a hot streak. Hot streak, baby! Let's go! Am I wrong? I thought... Yeah, no, we're on a hot streak. Yeah. On the hot streak. Yo, Green Lantern's cracked! Yo, it might be. <laughs> did we Did we just figure out, like, a sick list here? Maybe, maybe we cracked the code. I think we might have just cracked the code here. <laughs> Um, let's keep, let's keep playing. Why not? Yo, we are, thank you, man. We, we, we're cooking. This is a group effort. We're cooking together here. This is like when you do a potluck, when you do a potluck and everybody brings a little bit of food. We're, we're, we're cooking together here. This is a communal cook. <laughs> communal. <laughs> I brought barbecue. Hell yeah. <laughs> let's do it. Um, you know what? We go second. I'm gonna keep it. I, I, the hand isn't perfect, but it's not terrible. We start with fitting mentor. We play Simon second turn. I think I can live with this for now, and we might even give. Ooh. They do get some bandages though. The bandages are a little unfortunate, but we'll uh, we'll make do. We'll make do with this. It's a Steve Trevor, so maybe, you know what, we can play on our second turn, Lantern, maybe we can actually get to Alfred. So honestly, all in all, not too bad. Definitely could have been a lot worse. I'm surprised he didn't protect, oh, I guess he still could protect Alfred. No, he didn't protect Alfred. What? Why would you not protect Alfred? Alfred is like one of your best cards. May the gods grant us their favor. That seems wild to me. I I don't I don't get that at all. Uh, he could pop the shield. Uh, let's go here. I think I like having the strong board here. He could pull a Batarang still, but if he pulls the Batarang, he's got to waste it on Steve. Ah, uh, he got the Batarang. It is what it is, but look, like he had to use a gadget to get rid of Steve there. So I still feel like, all in all, hopefully we uh, we did okay there with the exchange. John Stewart's a six nine, or four nine. We also could give uh, super strength to John next turn. I bring the thunder. I wonder if Mira, Mira may not work in this deck. I don't know. 
It works for Kilowog, certain cards, but... Still doesn't kill him, though. He's still alive. He's still alive and kicking here. May the gods grant us their favor. Oh man, if we only had an energy blast at this moment. Alright, let's go for... Let's go for Chastelon. Ah, we didn't get him. We'll take the freebie. Just to, I'd say, block for now. I still have a few tricks up my sleeve. But man, the lantern's kind of, kind of coming in big here. Oh, he's gonna have a lightning bolt though. The lightning bolt probably lets him get rid of John here. Oh, tough pulls. Does he make the sacrifice? Wow. Nope. Okay. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We got Mira in the back. We got Hal in the front. That creates a wave. We can clear. Knock this out. And Batman is dead. See ya! And that's our turn. Oh, we're cooking now, guys. We are cooking! We are cooking. <laughs> and the crazy thing is we have another Hal here. We have another Hal. And this Hal is a 12-12. That's about to be a 24-24. Like, bruh. Bruh. That's four in a row. <laughs> That's four in a row. Guys, we're cooking. We're cooking. Ooh. All right, we go first. Let's send back everything here. All right. I think we hold the Antiope, because we can play her with Wonder Woman if they decide to trade this way. Alright, they had the Steve Trevor too. So they probably just clear everything here. Which is uh, unfortunate, but... Now we're just going to go face the Batman here. And actually we have two John Stewart's here, so that's another if we wanted to another 10 damage we could do over two turns. Always with the Steve Trevor, man. Always. Oh. 
They can trade that now, but I think that's okay. So both leaders are up here. They get a free sea creature. They probably uh, take out the Kilowog. Well, we get to clear the board, which is nice. Unless, well, depending on what they drop. No, we get to clear the board. Ah, uh, never mind. We almost got to clear the board. May the gods grant us their favor. All right, maybe we take out Aqua first, actually. We got Green Lantern next turn. Okay, here's the question, guys. We can take out Aqua here. I think we take out Aqua. Hopefully I don't regret that. Or maybe we don't. Uh... Okay, let's do that. He's down to one card. We're down to two cards. Still with a few tricks up my sleeve. Uh, hopefully I don't regret that. If he gets to play, if he has a bat cycle, I'm gonna regret it probably. That's it for Lantern. But that's his turn. May the gods grant us their favor. And we got Clark Kent in the back. Okay, let's go. Guys, we might we might keep this win streak going. We might keep this win streak going. Wow, he went for it. Oh. oh my god! He went for the bait! He went for the bait! Yo! What is that? Five in a row? The Ring of Truth, also known as Wonder Ring. <laughs> Zenji was saying that uh, Wonder Ring is his uh, name for this deck. But guys, so far, not gonna lie, this deck's doing pretty good. We're showing what the Lanterns can do.